Welcome. For those of you who've been with me since day one, thank you. For my new people, hey. So for today's recipe, we will be making honey garlic shrimp stir fry. So if you still have wontons from my last adventure, this will go great with this meal. If you don't, go back to the last adventure. Um, this is like a gourmet twist to shrimp and broccoli from the Chinese restaurant, but this is better homemade. So let's get to it. For this recipe, you will need one pound of shrimp that I've cleaned, deveined, and took the tail off, one fourth cup of low sodium soy sauce, salt and pepper to taste, three tablespoons of honey, two tablespoons of minced garlic or four garlic cloves, two teaspoons of cornstarch, two teaspoons of vegetable oil, and one bag of frozen broccoli. So first we're gonna start with cooking our broccoli. So you need one teaspoon of vegetable oil. I have my pot here on high, my pan, sorry. gonna swirl this here so that it's all over the pan and we're gonna put our frozen bag of broccoli so you're gonna cook the broccoli four to five minutes until they're tender while our broccoli is cooking we're gonna start mixing our ingredients to make our sauce so I got this bowl here I'm gonna pour your honey Honey stick, so make sure you get everything in your bowl. One fourth cup of water. Now your soy sauce. Now we whisk it together. Our broccoli is now tender, so we're gonna remove it and put it in a bowl. So you're gonna wipe your pan and then put another teaspoon of vegetable oil. So our pan is ready to go. So I'm gonna bring my shrimp over, which I pat it dry, and I'm just going to season it with salt and pepper. And now, for the best part, the shrimp. So you're gonna cook these until they're pink. And just make sure you stir them occasionally because shrimp cooks really fast. And you don't wanna overcook them where they're chewy. As you can see, they're already turning pink. As you can see, our shrimp are ready. So now we're gonna add our garlic. I'll stir that around so it's incorporated in everything here. Just have to let it cook for about a minute. We're gonna add our broccoli back in the pan. everything in. This is already starting to smell really good. We're gonna bring over that sauce we made earlier and add it to it. So we mix one tablespoon of cold water with our cornstarch in a separate bowl and now we're gonna pour this in the pan and this is really just to thicken the sauce. You're gonna cook this for about a minute or until you, your sauce thickens, and then you're done. So as you guys can see, our sauce is bubbling, which means it's thickening. So we're done, and we're ready to eat. Okay, so we're ready to taste. I paired this with white rice. I'm gonna get everything on my bike here. Perfect. It's 
good. This was a really good meal and it was quick and easy. So if you want to take a chance on this recipe, please take a picture and tag my Instagram page at G Culinary Adventures and be sure to share, like, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Until next time, bye!